Mr. Speaker, uh, I just want to uh, echo the words of uh, my good friend and uh, colleague, uh, member of uh, Calgary North. We both have a lot of common friends of uh, different faiths. Um, but today, we, we are all Canadians coming together to overcome the grief and to extend our sympathies and uh, show our solidarity to uh, Afzal uh, family. Um, as a member from Calgary North noted, um, four, four members of the family lost their lives. Uh, the Mrs. Uh, Afzal, the mother, grandmother, and the two parents of uh, Faiz, uh, Salman Afzal, the dad, and uh, Madiha, is the mother, and uh, his sibling, Emna Afzal. So Faiz lost all of them when they all went to walk um, in uh, London, Ontario. So, uh, and the only reason they were attacked was they looked different and they wore different dress. And, and uh, yeah, so I, I, I stand here on behalf of uh, people of uh, Calgary Edgemont to express our uh, grief and uh, to wish uh, Faiz um, may peace be upon him and he recovers soon. And I wanted him to know through his, uh, through his uh, relatives and friends, because it's going to be hard for, for his schoolmates and his uh, sister's schoolmates or his dad's uh, and, uh, or his uh, parents' uh, colleagues at work. Uh, fearing about this, thinking about this, so it's, uh, it's, we did the right thing today here by stopping our regular business, stepping aside uh, um, the agenda of the day and, uh, and uh, discussing about this motion to let this, uh, let this uh, um, racists and violent people in Canada and all across the world to know that the members of this legislature stands with the Muslim community in Alberta, in Canada, and across the world. So we are together with them. But uh, most importantly, this young Faiz, I wish him a, a, a speedy recovery. And uh, through the members here, member of uh, Calgary North, member from Calgary Cross, member from uh, Calgary McCall and uh, Edmonton Ellerslie, we're going to convey our solidarity to, to, to the Muslim community that we are with them. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.